you were a mistake. You see how The Rock reacted? He smiled. That's a sign of a very dangerous man. Cody, I want to know why you agreed to a tag team match on Saturday. I'll be honest. I'm nervous. I'm scared. I can't say, hey, I'll get him next year because I've already said that. But the story is no longer about myself. The story is about all of you who have followed me to the absolute ends. The story is about fans from my own family. Fans like my mother. She's the only one I got left. You represent all of us, and I'm just so happy to see you face to face. You are definitely my hero. So thank I you appreciate so much you. for those words. I received those words. <laughs> what an honor. Thank you so much. Yes, sir. Memphis, Tennessee. The Rockets come back home. Very special, as many of you know. I started my career here in Memphis, Tennessee. Good to see you. I remember many matches of you there. I know. I was just yeah, telling everybody how cool it is to come back here. The time I spent down here in Memphis wrestling here, Channel 5 every Saturday morning, Big Top Flea Market every Monday night. That time changed my life. Yeah. He don't want to see me. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Bruno Lauer from Walls, Mississippi, but everybody knows me as Downtown Bruno. I go back to 82, I think, or 83 with Rocky Johnson, Dwayne's dad, who was one of my mentors, one of my closest friends, like a second father to me. My relationship with The Rock is, we're not friends, we're family, we're brothers. I knew him ever since he was a child. We came up together, and now, he's no debate, no argument, no discussion one of the top 10 performers in the history of our profession. Watching Rock come back to Memphis, Tennessee and watch the way the audience explodes and reacts, that's saying something. You know, usually every single week, the Rock comes out here and he tortures and he scorches every city that he's in. But tonight, it's different. This city is different. You see, years ago, when The Rock first started his wrestling career, The Rock started right here in Memphis, Tennessee. Well before the big bright lights of WWE, I was here wrestling in the USWA as a man known as Flex Kavana. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking with that name, but I gave it a swing. This city is a little different, so this is the way The Rock will say this. Finally, The Rock has come back! We're gonna have some fun tonight. You wanna have fun? All right, let's have The Rock sing a song. Let's go, boys. Well, here's a little story about how Cody was born. This is historically accurate. Dusty's youngest son was just what he feared. He tried to raise him right, but he turned out too weird. That's when Dusty said with total frustration that drugs and cheap condoms was a bad combination. I know it keeps Cody awake to know he wasn't planned and he was a mistake. We love you, Memphis. <laughs> We had some fun. We're going to have another kind of fun. Cody, The Rock doesn't want to talk to you right now, but The Rock wants to talk to one person, and that's your mama. Mama Rhodes. The Rock knows that you're watching, so Mama Rose, let The Rock break it down for you. Your son Cody took something from me, and I'm going to make him pay. I'm going to make your family pay, and I'm going to make you pay. 
on WrestleMania night one, the Rock and Roman Reigns, we're gonna beat your son and we're gonna beat Seth Rollins, which puts us to night two. Bloodline rules, anything goes. Ah, uh, Mama Rhodes. You want your son to hand you that belt so bad, that Universal Championship, but that ain't gonna happen. You are gonna get a belt, but you're gonna get The Rock's belt. The Rock is gonna take this belt and he's gonna beat your son. He's gonna tear his flesh and he's gonna whoop him. He's gonna whoop him like a dog over and over again. The Rock is gonna take this belt full of your son's blood and The Rock is gonna walk right over to you, Mama Rhodes, and he's gonna hand you this belt. And you're gonna be crying just like your son and that's okay because then The Rock is gonna whisper in your ear, he's gonna wipe your tears away and he's gonna say, what can I say except you're welcome? That was a special crowd tonight. Memphis, I love you. I will never forget that night. It's an honor and a pleasure to come back home and I can't wait to do it again. If you smell what the final boss is cooking,